We have um, peer reviews that are done regularly. 11 peer reviews have been done so far. Now, what are peer reviews? We were fortunate, I was fortunate to be one of a group that went to America to be trained in how to conduct peer reviews and also to develop an instrument that is uniquely South African for peer reviews. And the whole process involves a group of teachers and principals, not experts from outside, but teachers going into a school and over a year, a day and a half, giving a reflection of what they see in the school. So it's purely evidence-based and we give feedback to the school on what we have observed um, through and what we have learned through uh, communication, through documents and um, just by visiting classes and, and observation. So we give feedback in the form of um, precise plays. That is all the things that we see that is working well and we, we tell the, the school um, after the day and a half, we give a verbal, verbal feedback and we tell the school that. Then we also um, look at areas for development. So these are issues that with just a minor change in practice could be remedied. Um, that we feel um, as the team uh, need to be maybe better managed or better handled. Then we look at big rocks. Now the big rocks are those areas that would need a major overall or major change in the way of thinking of the school involved. And um, most of the peer reviews that we've done so far, I've been involved in as a team member and a team leader in some, and well, our school has also been peer reviewed. And most of um, those reviews were met with uh, optimism, with um, acceptance, and just being very um, supportive, uh, as being very supportive of the school. And all of the schools have welcomed the um, uh, report given by the peer review team. Because the whole idea is not to go and look at what is going wrong at the school, but what is not working properly, but with the idea of support so that we could all grow one another. And I have learned um, through this process such a lot just by visiting other schools. And, and you, you go there and you observe, but you also have a back page where you think, oh, I can implement this at my school, oh, and this would work nicely at my school, and so on. So in that way, uh, you learn and you try and get your staff back at school to buy into these new ideas because you've seen it working at other schools. There's somebody who's done the experimentation and who's done the trial and it for you and you can just basically go in and, and implement. 